Now I'm not sure if it shows, but screen wipe is always thrown together at the last minute in a mad blur. And while we were making this episode, we heard the sad news of the death of Oliver Postgate, who was responsible for some of the finest children's TV programmes broadcast anywhere in the world. Together with artist Peter Fermin, he created Small Films, a two-man production company that crafted their treasures in an old cowshed in Kent. They started out with Ivor the Engine in 1959 for ITV, which was remade later in colour for the BBC. Following that, Nog in the Nog, a series of whimsical made-up tales about a tribe of Norsemen. They then ventured into animated puppetry with Pingwings and Pogel's Wood, before going on to create their best-known works, The Clangers and, of course, Bagpuss. All of the small film shows radiate a gentle and natural warmth. Watching them feels like snuggling up in front of a fireplace listening to a kindly uncle reading a bedtime story. There was nothing else to do, you know. When the wind doesn't blow, the ship doesn't go. But I was Captain Bagpuss. And I think what makes these shows so good, what makes them such a vivid part of so many childhoods, is the perfect pitch of every moment. Everything about them is just right. The character designs are simple and instantly accessible. They look homemade and that's part of their charm. I want Teddy Palmer! Please! 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 Then there's the soundtrack. A lot of modern kids' shows consist of endless screeching and zap sounds that beat you over the head and can be exciting, but also leave you feeling ultimately rather hollow. Contrast that with the deliberately sedate feel of the small film's productions. And they had a superb ear for creating sound effects that children could easily mimic the moment the programme had finished. Just think about the swanny whistle voices of the clangers. The beatbox rhythm of Ivor's engine. Or the marvellous carousel of just bloody lovely sounds that made up most of Bagpus, everything from Gabriel's gulp. Oh, look, look. Professor Yaffle's skittering walk and academic hemming. <laughs> that is nothing but a rotten old bottle. The mice on the mouse organ. <coughs> and of course, Bagmus's trademark yawn. <coughs> These are the sounds I hear in my own head when I remember my own childhood and Oliver Postgate put them there. <coughs> Speaking of sounds, let's not overlook his voice. Once upon a time, not so long ago, there was a little girl, and her name was Emily. Postgate's voice, sometimes soothing, sometimes playful, was as modest and charming as everything else in the programmes. There's almost a hypnotic quality. Your consciousness seems to alter slightly the moment he starts to speak. Bagpuss, dear Bagpuss, old fat furry catpuss, wake up and look at this thing that I bring. Wake up, be bright, be golden and light. Bagpuss, oh hear what I sing. And there was a simple poetry to his scripts too, which suited his voice just so. He had a particular knack for drawing you in at the start of an episode, adjusting your filter, if you like, for what was to come. This calm, serene orb, sailing majestically among the myriad stars of the firmament. Perhaps this star too is home for somebody. Can we imagine the sort of people that might live on a star like this? Let us go very close. Let us look and listen very carefully. And perhaps we shall see. And hear. And all of these things, the selection of just the right characters, just the right soundtrack and just the right tone is an incredibly hard thing to pull off in TV, incredibly hard. You can't fake it, you can't screw up your face and slog your way through it. It only occurs when an innate facet of someone's character is allowed to bleed into the production giving it a unique personality and resonance all of its own. That's what Oliver Postgate achieved. It's immensely rare, and it's probably only now that he's gone that we'll truly appreciate the perfectly formed little gifts that he left for us. Bagpuss gave a big yawn and settled down to sleep.
will stick of it, every little bit of it. We will fix it like new, 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 new. We will fix it like new, new, new.